First off, the lighting sucks because there's a lamp right there. I'm in the living room, chilling. Let's put a pillow behind my head. Yeah, that's so much better. Not really. I decided the vlog is like 9 o'clock at night. I just got done watching a few things. Let's take that pillow out because it's not very comfortable. Um, I watched last night's Dancing with the Stars. What else did I watch? Um, an Alan episode of The Late Late Show with Stephen Colbert. I think that's it. Dad's calling bingo tonight because it's Tuesday. And, uh, just kind of a low-key day. I did get up and I had to go, um, take page. I called my cousin. I hope my dad remembered to take that to the accountant. Um, I called him. I said, do you want me to bring paychecks there and pick up that envelope for the accountant? He's like, yeah, that'd be very helpful. So... Me and dad went up to the shop and my cousin was wrenching on one of our trucks because there was an issue with the water pump uh, that pumps the water out of the 400 gallon fresh something, some pump was out. <clears throat> and Dexter was there helping, who is a, a guy who's been helping at the shop. Um, he doesn't drive, he just helps uh, maintain stuff and... Uh, if, if it comes to it, he might train him on a local route. The guy who was supposed to start today did not start today. He, I guess his dad had some sort of surgery yesterday. It didn't go that great. And his dad not doing the best. And he figured this is not the time to try to train and do a new job with so much going on. So we're st still at square one with uh, hiring a driver. It is what it is. Uh... And then we've had some issue with the health department because of uh, stuff. And one of the businesses. Oh, it's so fun at times. But it all gets straightened out. Yes, it will. So it was nice to finally meet who Dexter was. And I saw the goat. He's still out at the shop. He's in the shaded area. He has a little... Uh, metal half, you know those little metal things that are shaped like a U, it's a shelter, he goes in there, but he wasn't in there, he was curled up in a ball next to a tree, because uh, dad didn't see my first and he was like, back up, and I'm like backing up, and there he is over, over there, um, <clears throat> I wish I had one of those photos to show you of him in a top hat, he had had a tuxedo bow on, but he didn't like it, he was in a wedding out there, and since the wedding, he has not left the property. Although he should call Dalton and ask Dalton what he's going to do with his goat. I have no idea who's taking care of the goat. Uh, I don't know. We have a shop cat and we have a goat. How that happened, I don't know. Uh... <laughs> We have a goat. That makes me laugh. Oh, man. What else is happening? Um, let me see if I can think of a story to tell. Do I have any good stories? I can't think of anything right now. My brain is not working correctly. Well, I can go on with the rest of my day. We left the shop after talking to Ronnie for a few. Grabbed that pack of stuff for the accountant. Uh, took a ride by Lake Michigan. Beautiful day at the lake. Beautiful. A few people at the beach. Um, then we went around and stopped at Rio's. Mexican restaurant through the drive-thru. I had a coupon for 50% off a combo, so I used the coupon. And then Dad... Uh, I asked what the specials were, and it's Taco Tuesday. So Dad got a few tacos, but I got the large burrito combo because I, if I cut it in half, it's plenty for him and I both. So I got home and I cut the burrito in half, and it was <laughs> we still didn't eat it all. We, t we each had a couple bites left. We're like, we're done. Anybody who can eat that whole thing, they have to be something, man. 
we still have some tacos left. I was going to have them tonight for dinner, but I'm just not hungry. That half burrito is still floating around in there going, Ooh, you know. And then we stopped at a bakery. I used the coupon there to get buy six chocolate chip cookies, get six free. I might have one of those in a minute. I'm not, I'm not, I can, I can eat one of those. <laughs> They're my favorite. I don't get them very often, so. Uh, and the bakery does a really good job. Dad got himself a apple square with this glazy stuff on it. Not my thing. Chocolate chip cookie. And then we came home. Yep. That's been our day. Thrilling, I know. But next week, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be out and about, and I'm going to be taking videos. I will be, I probably told you yesterday, but I'll be going to the flea market, and then one day I'll be going to the fair, if Dad feels up to it. So, I plan on vlogging out and about both of those days. I know one thing for sure. I can't wait till December to upgrade my phone so I can get way more space on my phone. <laughs> I want more space. I want more space. I'm getting as many gigs as I can on my phone next time. I might even go with the plus size so it's a little bit bigger. I tend to lay in bed at night sometimes and watch movies on Netflix on my phone. So um, that'll be nice. I uh, What did I watch the other night? I've been watching documentaries real life with Lisa Lang. Some of her shows on Netflix. Um... I still need to finish up Rosemary and Time's second season. I have not done that. Um, I've been kind of on the downswing in Netflix lately, but we will see. I, wa I watched a stupid movie on there. You know those movies that are they're just stupid movies. And this one was called, what was it called, Muffin Top? Oh, it was so dumb. But then David Arquette was in it also. And he had, <laughs> I laughed every time I heard him talk because he had a, his character was British. Oh, it was hilarious. Just hearing him talk in a British accent just cracked me up. I'm like, are you kidding me? Come on now. Oh, it made me laugh. It, it is a really stupid movie. Just so you know. Um, and then I watched one. Dorfman. Hmm. I don't know what that one was. It was, it was. it was an okay movie. I need to watch Cake with um, Jennifer Aniston. I've heard that's really good. And I, oh, and I watched uh, White or Black the other day with, um, dang it, Kevin Costner. Oh, man, that hurt my brain a little. That was good. That was a good movie. Um... I don't know what else. I'm just talking. I was bored and I wanted to chat. And I chose you. All of you. To chat with. While I sat in the recliner. This one. This one. Well this is dad's recliner of the moment. His regular recliner is over there. I don't know if you can see it. Where is it? Where is it? It's right here. That's his old recliner. This is my um, cousin Bart's. This is my Uncle Joe's, re actually, when he was alive, when his cancer was really bad and he was really weak and had to have help uh, getting up. And then we've borrowed this once before when Dad had uh, um, surgery before for an... Uh... Dang it, what's the word? I'm not going to leave until I forgot the word. It's a hernia. And uh, I don't remember which one because we rented one once because that was before Uncle Joe had one. Because my dad's had a herniated belly button repaired and then a hernia down in the groin. He has that hernia now in his stomach that I call his alien. It's really creepy. And he's gone to the doctors a couple times for it and they've checked it. And they're like, as long as it's not painful, don't really worry about it. But once it starts getting painful, he'll have to have surgery on that. But he has no problems with it now. It just looks creepy. Creepy. Yeah. I call it his alien in his belly. Because it looks like an alien in his belly. Trying to pop out. Alright, I'll shut up now.
this is one of the vlogs it's just really you know my theme of a whole lot of nothing yep that's how it rolls oh 10 minutes oh goodness hey bye